So this is my first son, his name is Max. He loves playing basketball. So my typical weekend, naturally being a parent, starts with driving him to a sport, so his basketball. But at that level, at the end of the game, they simply give you two things what your team scored and what the other team scored. And that's it. I'm working IT. I'm a database guy. I want more than this. I like data. So what did I do? I went over to apex.oracle.com and created myself a little mobile app, which has actually let me type in all the scores. So what happens now is while they're playing, every time someone scores, I simply type in what quarter it was, timestamp when they scored, how many points they scored. So of course, as people start asking you information about, you know, once they found out you're storing it, they start sending you, hey, I wouldn't mind some information. So the coach asked me something like this. I need the raw data plus some quarter by quarter totals and the grand total. Now that's three requirements, that's easy to do. There's the raw data, that's easy enough for a query. There's the quarter by quarter total, it's just done with a simple group by and there's the grand total. That doesn't seem to be too intelligent. I got given a single requirement, please give me a report like this. And I had to write three SQLs for that. In a more real world situation, that's not particularly efficient to do. Can I get from three down to two? Well, I can using a thing called a roll up. A roll-up lets me do this. I can do one query for the raw data as before, but to get the quarter by quarter totals and the grand total, I can do a roll-up. If I do roll-up by quarter, I get the four quarters and then it rolls up to the grand total as well. So I've eliminated one query. This is a good result. But that's still messy if I'm turning this into a Java application or any other kind of application because I've now got two result sets. One's the raw data, One's the subtotals and the grand total. And if I'm going to present that in a logical fashion, I've probably got to fold it together. I've got to get all the raw data, then realize, that, oh, that's the last row for quarter one. Therefore, I now need to bring the subtotal down, proceed into the next quarter, etc. I need to have more complexity in my application code to actually use this data. Wouldn't it be cool if you could get all that information just in one query with one pass through the data? And you can. We could do something like this, which is a bit of a cheat. I could still do a group by roll up, but I could say roll up by the primary key. And the primary key obviously is one row or one entry per row, which means rolling up by primary key is actually getting the raw data. So what happens is group by roll up with the quarter and the primary key means I get the raw data, which is effectively a roll up by quarter and primary key. Then I get the quarter totals and then I get the grand total. And you can see it's all presented beautifully in order for me. There's the raw data, then the quarter total quarter two, and then quarter four, all the way down to the grand total at the end. This leaves me with an application that requires no code. It literally is open a cursor, fetch that, and it's already ready to present. Literally, I just print it on the screen. It's that easy.